allows us to live this day. So, let me say that by the grace of God, we will get each educational foundation of what, you know, where it should be and what it should be. Uh, it shouldn't be uh, the dog, you know, the tail wagging the dog. It should be the dog wagging the tail. When it comes to honestly and truly, I have become, you know, an apostle of um, let's start what we can now. That is, I, I am getting, I want to say I'm getting frustrated, and I, I, I'll explain. Some of you who are very well to do, I think that is that appears in my view to be what is our problem. You know, if you want to build a house, if you're well to do, you need to get the expert to look at the soil, you know, look at the, do the design, landscape, you know, all that. But you know some other folk who wants to build the same house, we just dig the foundation and, you know, because I yeah, they are joy, say, this other man, how did he, that's my neighbor, how did he build it all? So I, like, for instance, we, the old boys undertook to do the gate house. And, and when they gave me, that's the first thing that should have started now, you know, after the last home coming. When they gave me a bill of uh, about 14 million to do gate house, if I was not deep in that conference, say, what kind of uh, gate house are we building? So, um, meanwhile, our budget, the money we have is something like five million. So, even that estimate alone is sufficient to, but if you go into that estimate, you will see that um, maybe drawing, design, this and all that, we may have taken a sizable chunk of the money. But I, I want to say that we are behind schedule. We're behind schedule, and I'm an apostle of whatever we can do, let us do. And I give an example. When I was commissioner for house, I built a deal uh, on behalf of the government, I built a deal of house in Exeter. If I waited for drawing, disabilities, and all that, it wouldn't have come. Mm -hmm. But the moment we started, other people started to show interest in the estate. And before you know it, we built the estate using other people's money, not even government money. So I have been an apostle of saying whatever we can do, either as a class, either as a brand, should be known. About what the, the thinking is, let's, uh, let's all start and stop. But if you build a house, you know that once you start and the blood starts coming up, you have some form of enthusiasm. You want to keep committing money until you get to finish when, when you put the money, you will not uh, see it. So I am, I am of the firm belief that if we start, we will accomplish it. Rather than waiting for when the, the thing will, that will have all the money and then um, be in a position to stand and finish. If that school was taken over by me, I would have started because all I need to do is remodel the quadrangular block, that's the classroom block. Get the second, that's the lower field, the lower gate functional. And then get one of the Rex and maybe Fisher House working. And before you know it, the biggest investment in Nigeria that attracts funding is education. You certainly see. So I do know that um, from all indications, we want to like uh, the one the Fisher Educational Foundation should that that like six, seven months behind, going by the last day. You know, we had our homecoming in October. So they are behind. And um, we are working very hard. It is actually the funding. What we have 
you know, when you want to collect money from this bank these days, they need you to show your own money. So if we now use our money, use up our money, we, are, we will not be in a position to no. meet the no. deposit uh, requirements to the loan. So that is, so I'm saying that it's actually the loan now that is a bit, you know, that is slowing us down because it's been underwritten by Union Bank and all that. So that money, the, all the money we have is now we have awaiting the approval. I think I have uh, attempted the question. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.